Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of a new box that I got sent. This is called the Sweet Sparkle Box, and I've never heard of this box before, but I was sent this to review for you guys, so I'm going to give you my honest thoughts about it. I'm going to show you what's inside the box, and then at the end I'm going to tell you about the price, where you can get it, and I'll have that link below, and then I'll kind of give you my final thoughts. So let's go ahead and get into this unboxing. So this is what the box looks like when you get it in the mail. The box is really cute. I really like it. Right here it just says sweet sparkle and I like that it's a pinkish red design. I personally think it's cute. When you open it up like this, I did already open it to go through the packaging to make sure nothing was broke. It comes with this really cute wrapping. It has a S right there. It's wrapped in blue and then right here it says hey pretty and then has hashtag my sweet sparkle and I think it's packaged very cute. You guys know that I'm a sucker for packaging so that's definitely something that I look for especially in these boxes and when you open it up here is the contents of the the box. So the first thing that I'm pulling out of the box right here is from City Color and this is a contour and define book and it comes with four different shadows. So this is a contour, I think this is a bronzer, a highlight, and then a blush. So that's really cool and I think that this retails for $11.99. I could be wrong about that but I will list the prices either on the screen or in the description whichever I decide to do. So this is pretty cool because it's a nice little contour kit. Um, I'm really curious to know, I think the bronzer would probably be better for my fair skin, but I do love the blush, it's more of a darker shade, so I'm actually really excited about this. So the next thing that's in the box is an eyeshadow palette from Jordana, Jordana, I'm not sure how to say that. It's got neutral shades, but there is a pop of pink right here. I really like the color scheme, but I think that I'm going to save this to give away for you guys. I don't remember how much this costs, but again, I will leave it on the screen or in the description, whichever I decide to do. But this is the Made to Last eyeshadow collection, and there looks like there's six shades. So I'm really excited. I think these colors are nice. I don't know about the quality of it because I'm not going to swatch it because I am going to be giving it away to one of you guys in an upcoming giveaway that I'm doing because I have way too many eyeshadow palettes that I don't use. So you guys can let me know what you think of it if you win it. So the next thing in the box is something that I'm actually really excited about. It's a brush from Wet n Wild. This is a contour brush and I've been looking for these brushes all over and I never can find them so getting them in this box is really exciting. Um, I think this retails for like 99 cents but I'm not exactly sure but I think that these look really nice and I'm actually really excited to feel the quality of it so I'm going to test it out here because I am going to keep this because I'm excited about it. So this is actually really soft. I love that it's white and pink. That's totally colors that I love so I'm actually very 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 this is probably the most exciting thing in the box so far for me. So the next thing in here is from Revlon and this is a Kajal in Intense eyeliner and brightener, so one side is black and one side is white. I love white liner, so I'm really excited to try this, and I think that I'm actually gonna test it out for you guys here. I probably will get more use out of the white side than I will the black because if you guys watch my videos, you know that I don't really do eyeliner a lot of the time, so I'm gonna test that one out. Um, I do have foundation on my hand, so it's not showing up very well, but I'm really excited about that. That'll be great for the waterline. And just for the video, whoa, that's really intense. I'm going to swatch the black one as well. That black one's very pigmented. <laughs> I'm actually pretty impressed with that. So I'm really excited about this. And I think this retailed for $7.99. But I could be wrong. I'm not sure exactly. Everything's going to be listed in the description or on the screen when I show the products. So you will know for sure. But... Um, this isn't something that I'm like super stoked about. I do like the white a lot, but I'm not really big on eyeliner, so this is something I could have definitely went without. The next thing is a mascara form from the brand Jordana or Jordana. I'm not trying to say that. This is the Best Last Extreme Volumizing Mascara, and I feel like I've heard a lot of people talking about this actually, so I'm really, really excited to try this out, and I would love to do a first impressions for you guys because I love doing mascara first impressions, so I will end up probably filming that shortly, but I'm really excited about this. I have a lot of mascara mascaras to go through but I think that a lot of people talk highly about this one so I'm really excited to try this. So the next things here go together and I'm not going to be swatching these because I probably will be giving them away to you guys because they're red lip products and I don't really wear a lot of red lip products. The first one here is from Clean Color. This is a red lip liner. Um, I think this retailed for $1.49 but again I will have the exact price on the screen or in the description and I'm going to be giving this away to you guys because I'm not really big on red lip products so I'm not really wearing them a lot and I 
I wanted to go to somebody who will get use out of it. So this is going to be given away. And then the next thing is from the brand called Rude Makeup with Attitude. And this is a notorious liquid lip color. I love liquid lipsticks, but this is a red color. And I'm just not big on red shades. But this red shade is really pretty, actually. So, um, I don't know if this has a name. Oh, it's called Radical Red. And um, it's going to pair perfectly with this lip liner. So whoever gets this is going to have to send me photos of you wearing it. Because it's going to look gorgeous on you. I'm not giving away those products in this video exactly. I'm going to be doing another giveaway shortly for you guys. So you guys can watch out for those in that next giveaway. So that was everything that I got in this month's box. Each month they do a theme. And the theme this month was All American Girl. So all the products that were included in this box. is supposed to help you curate a makeup look that goes with a theme. Which was All American Girl. I do think that everything paired very well together. And I thought that you guys got a lot of products. But this box does retail for $21 a month. And I will have the link below for the website if you guys want to check it out. Personally, to me, I think that's a pretty steep price for a subscription box. And I think that if you're going to be paying that much for a subscription box, you should be getting higher end products. You definitely get your money's worth with everything that I got in this box. And I will have the total below if I can find it of how much all the products in this box retailed up for. Two of the products in this month's box were bonus items. Um, that was a City Color Contour and Define Palette and then the Wet n Wild Contour Brush. So those are just bonus items that I don't think normally would come in the box. I don't know if they did something extra this month or what happened, but those do say bonus on my paper here that I have. So Personally, I think the box is really great. You get a lot of different products and a lot of brands I've never heard of, but I would not be paying $21 a month for this. That's just me personally. Let me know in the comments if you guys are picking this box up or what you thought of it, and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!